Hello. How are you all today? Welcome to Ladder to Learn. Basically, this is the first video in our channel. We are trying to uh, start a basic algebra course in which we will try to provide the basic concepts of algebra in very uh, simple way to the beginners. So this is the episode number one. So let me uh, clear you what is algebra. Well, uh, algebra is a branch of mathematics which deals with symbol. Now, uh, it's actually very simple. Algebra tries to solve math using symbols. Suppose uh, in any mathematical problem, you do not know any quantity of uh, any quantity. Instead of uh, patenting you do not know that, you can just put a symbol there and try to solve the equation, making an equation so or anything like that try to solve the mathematical problem problem using uh, this symbol well now you can use any symbol uh, from a to z it can be a b c d or it can be x y z or anything like that but it will be small letters of course well now these uh, symbols actually means variables the variables um, that means the values are that are not fixed that can be it can be any unknown numbers well uh, it can be 5 10 15 20 or uh, 1 2 3 or anything whichever uh, one or whichever answer we have uh, got after solving the problem now uh, before starting let's know a little uh, history about algebra uh, Algebra uh, is uh, came from the word uh, algebra, Arabic word, which means the reunion of broken heart. Well, actually, it's kind of look like solving any mathematical problem or something like that. Well, uh, Persian mathematician Al Khwarizmi is considered the father of algebra. The algebra word is came uh, it came from his book. So. Now let's uh, start our main discussion. Well, algebra is kind of similar to arithmetic problem uh, because uh, it has all the features of uh, all the features like uh, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, or something like uh, or other features uh, in algebra too. So you can suppose if you uh, su suppose you can use. Uh, in arithmetic we uh, we we can add 2 or 2 equal to 4 so in algebra we can make 2x plus 2x equal to 4x it's very simple now let's uh, see how to use algebra to sol solve any uh, mathematical problem uh, we can uh, take an example here suppose you have a uh, you have five apples okay and your four friends have four apples so you have total nine apples now let's say you know you have total nine apples and you know you have five apples but you do not know your friends uh, your friend have how many apple your friends have so your friend have so now uh, how to solve this problem so there will be an equation that you have five apple your friends have x apple so there will be total nine pro apple now it's an equation okay so the value of uh, an equation of the the value of both sides will must be equal so the value of five plus x will be equal to value of nine here x is the unknown value so if we have to get the value of x we have to eliminate the others from the left side if we eliminate any number from the left side we have to eliminate the same number from the right side that's the rule of equation the both sides should be equal all the time now let's solve the math here the equation is 5 plus x is equal to 9 so let's eliminate 5 from the left side in the meantime eliminate 5 from the right side so the equation will be so the solution will be x is equal to 4 let's solve another equation suppose 
suppose you need $100 to buy a video game you have only $50 now you need X dollar more so the equation will be 50 plus X equal to 100 now let's solve the problem here 50 plus X equal to 100 eliminate 50 from the left side eliminate 50 from the right side so that you get X equal to 50 so you need $50 more so the concept here is to make the both side equal all the time and eliminate others so that's all for today uh, you can try to create some mathematical problem by own self and solve them if you need any help you can comment in the comment box and if you like this video you can share it with your friends and uh, subscribe my channel for the other updates thank you